How y'all doing? Doing good. How are you? Doing good. Got your hands on one Yeah. <laughs> Had my hands on two. It was great awareness by the wide receiver to come knock it out, so <sighs> kudos to him. <laughs> Happier about the one that you ended up with, or are you more Of course, happy? you know, whenever the defense get their hands on the ball and, you know, uh, create a turnover, it's just, it, it's an awesome play. So um, just saw um, one of our guys uh, tip that thing up, and man, I, I didn't know if I could get there. I just ran as hard as I could, and man, it just fell in there. It felt like Christmas, you know? So it was awesome. When the defense gets a start like it does, where you guys are able to kind of put the ball for the offense in the red zone, do you feel it gets contagious where you guys are like, okay, let's do another one, let's make another big play, let's make another big play? Yeah, you know, we we prepare ourselves every week to come out and uh, you know start fast, and and that's that's the biggest thing we can do. And whenever I get in there on defense, you know, if the momentum's like that, you know, you just want to keep feeding the fire and be prepared to do so. So you know when. When my number gets called up and I'm in there, man, I want to feed to that fire. So starting fast is always awesome. When it gets late in the game and you guys are shutting them out, do you feel more pressure to, to maintain that shutout for kind of a, the guys to start You know, the, as the game goes on, you know, of course, obviously, you get you know, more fatigued and all that. So I just think for me, and um, I can't really speak for the other guys, but for me, I just want to just try to be as fundamentally sound as I can during those times. because. I'm tired, the, the game's almost over, the other guys are tired, you know, it just comes down to that, like, you know, who can be fundamentally sound and what can I do to, you know, in my position and my part of, you know, whatever defense we're in, special teams, whatever it is, if I can just, you know, play, you know, and do my job as fun, like technique sound as possible during those times, I take that as a win, because then you just keep crafting. So, you know, I just want to craft during those times, even though, <laughs> You know, in my mind, I'm like, I'm crafting. And then you watch the film, you're like, dang, you look like you loafing, you know? So, <laughs> so you know, it's a, it's a everyday thing. You just got to keep working at that, so. What did seem to be clicking for you tonight? Because you were in on a lot of plays and a bunch of different areas of the field. Yeah, and that's the beauty of, of defense, man. It, you know, if you end up with the sack or if you end up with the interception, you know, that interception wasn't me. I just ran to the ball, and that was... The, the ball was tipped high enough for me to get there on time. The sack opened up, you know, we, our D linemen were just going, you know, penetrating and doing their things and it opens up. So, you know, when we rewatch the film, I'm gonna exactly know who to go to and say, hey, thank you. So, so I, it feels good when, you know, when you, the defense starts, you know, clicking like that and you come up with one. So, can't wait to check out the film. Harvey, are you guys preparing to see Hurts tonight? And then how does that change the plan? And he's a great player, and you know, obviously we all know that. And you also just got to be prepared for him. If he's out there or not out there, of course you got to, you know, of course go out there and do my job and do what I need to do. But when he, when he's in there, of course you got to be high high alert, high awareness because he's super athletic, can move, and um, uh, so yeah, we you know you also got to just be prepared for him and prepare be prepared for anyone that's on the opposite end of the depth chart. So. How much did that help? I'm not, not because I don't want him to be hurt. But he came down, he was out, out for warm ups, and then he came down and he got sick. So there's kind of adjustments that you guys had to make to the guys that are going to play, but that can happen in the real game. So yeah, of, of course. Out. Yeah, of course. You know, things can happen like that. We all know we're in a. You know, we play a game that things can just change on a dime, momentum, whatever it is. So preparation's key and executing it's even better. So it's um, for sure got to prepare for whatever situation happens if it's that situation. All right, thank you guys. Good night, good night, good night.